help you stop. Like it'll take you step by step. It'll say, do this. Now do this. Now do this. Now do this. So these are really helpful. Oh, you still know how to write it. Oh, well that I can easily show you next week. Not next week, but the next week. Okay. Me, you know where I come in next week at y'all? You know? I think it's. Are your kids off? They were off this week, but they're also off on Monday. So on Monday, we get to have time Monday. together. And then, then yeah, so I'm going to help team move on Tuesday. And then the rest of the week is That's kind awesome. of mine, which is, which is nice. It's really nice. And then I'm going to Indy tomorrow. And I'm going to see the Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
It was just there. I saw it there. I'm like, what is this? And someone must have put it there. Are you sure? Yeah. What if I bribe you? You can bribe me. I'm fine. Michael can do it. What if I bribe you with two? I'll do it. I'm fine with you. Nobody else do it. Okay, so you know the song? What song? <laughs> you know what you're talking about? Um, not really. What are we doing? Okay, so read the first part. Quadratic formula is negative B. I know the song. How about we do as a group? I don't know. No? I don't know. We all get candy. You don't know? If you all get candy? Oh, yeah. Bribery. What about the If I have enough. What about his rap part? Okay, so how about the rap part for Philip? I missed the L on your name. Did you sharpen it up? I can sharpen it up though. You can sharpen it up? Right. Okay. Do <laughs> you want to come in front? Or just do it like that? No, you can do it? Okay. Okay, let me get it out. Let me get it out? Okay. Alright, so right now, Philip is going to sing his rap melody, the uh, quadratic formula. Feel free. If you want to buy, it'll be on CD next month. So, yeah. do amazing. Yeah. Have your iTunes, yeah, of course. Abby, I'm wearing that shirt too, I think. Maybe. I'm not sure. I think I am. Yeah. You ready, Phil? Okay. Yeah. Okay, so everyone, just listen to Philip. He's going to be famous one day, so make sure you keep eye on him. Alright. Alright, so. And I'm going to get there. Alright, so. Alright, so. Okay, we're trying to beat. X equals minus B plus or minus next square root. B <laughs> to the second power minus 4 AC. <laughs> B is all over 4 2 A. Perfect. So now we need four volunteers. Four. Four volunteers. We need four. To do what? To do no. what? Page. 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 It's not Page. hard. It's not Page. hard. Page. Are we singing? Page. We're not singing. We're not writing stuff on the board. Oh, oh me? Okay. Okay, so just come up here. And. Lewis? Okay. So, the first one, everyone else should be. Filling out the warm up. That's exactly what they'll be doing. So you can do, you're going to enter the quadratic formula. You're just going to write down. And let's see. Yeah, so Ramesha will do the roots. Actually, yeah, let's do the roots instead. You want to do the line of symmetry? Square root four. Okay. okay. You can do the quadratic formula. So I'm going to do right now. So here's. I think it works. Yes. Okay. Um, so just wait until you can do yours first. The and then, yeah. Um, okay. okay, and then here we go. Like a so everyone else, again, should be drawing their own. Yeah, we just what? make it up. Like, yeah, make it up, or you could use what I wrote down. You remember what I drew that one time? No. Oh. With a face? Oh, yeah. You can do that or something else. Okay. So don't write
Like in China. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, Oh no, because you know what I'm going to say. Oh, okay. kind of course it is. They're sponsored by the tech one. They are. If they say they're best for sale. So you think we will get that? You know that? No way. How about you say, or you just say, God, you know, I'm going to say, 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 so how is the drawings coming along for everyone else? You can either copy it or just come up with something on your own, how you, you think you remember. I'm off the root or the x-intercept. So it's going to y is equal to what? Factors. Zero. Yeah. So it's like this? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Right back street. So does that look like something that you could uh, help you remember? Yes. Okay. okay, so we have the quadratic formula, guys. Okay, real quick. Good. Okay, so we have the quadratic formula, which we should all know. Hopefully by next Monday we'll be able to still memorize it. And the root, she drew a tree because the roots are on the ground. And the roots are what? The x-intercept, right? So that's what y is equal to? Zero. Zero. So if you think about the ground is the x-intercept, then that's where the roots are. So there we go, we have the roots. And we have a face drawn, a good face, better than mine, the one I drew. And if you look at the line of symmetry, you see that the eyes are equal distance apart from the line of symmetry. Same with the areas. So if we went, found the distance between the line of symmetry and one of the areas, we could find the distance from the line of symmetry to the other area. Which one You have a question? Which one is that? Which one? So X and Y. Oh, this is X. This is Y. Okay. So, I need one more volunteer. First of all, what? Why are you sitting there? Michael. Yes. No, you. Well, everyone who wants to volunteer, raise your hand. Okay, so you have to pick out of it. So everyone who's raising their hand, you have to pick. I can't tell you what it's for. Do you know what it's for? You guys are volunteering without even knowing what it's for. That's all. First of all, I have no shame at all. We know. Evan. You go. You get the song. Okay, so go ahead and come up here, please. We need to get Kevin. Okay. I think it's below. Maybe it's the next page. Is that cool? Okay, so you guys can take a minute to read this smart candy game. And this is what you'll be playing. So I'll give you again one minute to read up on it. Right now. No, why are you asking me? I know, why are you asking me? When's the last time I if you guys got a homework assignment? Don't act up on purpose, if you pay attention, take notes, then we have no homework. You guys act up. I'm not going to 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 act up. i am Dump Evan. So if Evan cannot answer it, then he keeps the candy. If he can't answer it, then Kyle has to give up his candy to Evan. However, if you don't know, you can ask for the class. If they get it right, that means you have to give them one of the candy. Everybody? Well, he gets two candy, so in a way, you, if they get it right, you get to keep one, but you get one away. So you'll still get a candy if you get it right. So he's asking, what is the vertex form? To think y is equal to something. You can ask for help, but you only can choose one person. So a person you think will know the answer if you don't know. Oh, that's not So however, if you don't ask them, you get both of the candies. Oh, okay. If you get it right. But if you don't, then you only get one of the candies. Mm -hmm. A. Mm -hmm. 
parentheses. Sorry. Yes. X minus H. That's fine. You can keep it. I can keep it. Let's keep it. Let's keep it. Okay. Close parentheses. Squared X. My plus K. Perfect. Okay. So you have to get up to K. I hate you. <laughs> All right. Here's over. Okay. Perfect. So real quick, what is the vertex? Looking at this, what is our vertex? HK. HK? Yeah. Perfect. So what is the first variable thing? You know, yes. what color this one? That. First one is Y? First one is parentheses. X? X. Okay. Right. So we have Y is equal to A times in parentheses X minus H squared plus K. So go ahead and write that down. Anything we write down up here or that you feel like you should write down as notes, just write that down. Alright, so as a reminder, we went over the continuous squares, and today we're going to be learning about the vertex form, which you should have a kind of idea of what it is. Just looking at this. We'll just go in more detail what this is. But first, I want to go, I want you guys to get in pairs. So we're going to go either, first of all, how do you guys do on the homework? We had two questions on the homework. I had trouble with the first one. I, 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 I did the first one, I didn't do the second one. Okay, so we're not going to do what's on here. We'll do that completing square question, but you're going to work in pairs. And the ones who have trouble, if you both have trouble, you can ask me. Um, hopefully one of you guys will understand something, you can help the other person. So let's say Jordan and Hunter, um, Abby and Kyle, you two, you two, you two, and then, then Ronisha and you two. Does that work, work out? Yeah. Two, two, two. Okay. So go ahead and get in your pairs and work on the first problem of your homework. The first problem. The first problem. You got five minutes. And we'll go over it if you guys are really Bye bye bye. Bye bye bye. On my bye bye. It was. So number, I think it was number three, right? Yeah. It should have been three in the homework, so there should be two problems. Yeah, the next one. Next one. It should. Um, it was yesterday's work. Yeah. It should say completing the squares after notes in class work at home. So you guys should be working on number three. So number three is the one that you should be working on. The one where it says graph y equals x squared minus 8x minus 3. And you have to do it by completing the squares to find the root. Questions? Anyone who doesn't have one, I've got some extra ones up here. Okay. So again, you guys have partners, so kind of talk about what you guys don't understand and maybe the other person can help you guys out and so just try complete this. If you can we'll go over it in five minutes. So how do you do this? Negative 
So if I subtract 19 from both sides, and this will give us x, x minus 4 squared minus 19. Is that vertex form? Yes. Yes. What is our vertex? Well, where's the a in the form? Okay, it's this one. So what's our vertex? Uh, 4, 19. Positive 4, right? Yeah, switch the first and now second one. Oops, this is our root. So we have, we're changing the first one, but not the second. Nice. We're good with that? Yeah. Okay. So how do you find our roots? Solve for x. Solve for x. Perfect. We're going to do it down below. Let's see what we have first. So we're going to take, are you guys fine with me just starting with this right here? As long as I, this is what we had, but all we're going to do is add 19 to both, both sides, right? Yeah. And we'll get this. So this is what I'm going to start with. So x minus 4 squared. 19. x minus 4 squared is equal to 19. And how do I solve for x? How do I get rid of that square? Square root. Both sides. What am I forgetting? Plus or minus. So we have x minus 4 